Hey, it's Jocelyn. I'm here with Mr. DeSanto, who coaches the debate team, which I think is gymnastics. That's right, Jocelyn. This weekend, we go against King's Head Island, and if we win, we'll be bringing home the first trophy for the Wagstaff Trophy Case. You mean the turtle tank? Well, it's supposed to be a trophy case. But there are turtles in it. Which is going to change. We are going to be bringing home the iron. But where will the turtles live? I don't, f I don't know. I don't know. Just don't make it about the turtles, Jocelyn. Man, that bot's wrapped him around her little wheel. You know, she's probably using AI on him. Wait, AI like as if? Yeah, as if. Oh my god. I know. You two are making me feel smart. But guys, I mean, I'm pretty sure none of us can afford to get a D in this class, right? Mm, I'm getting A's and B's in all my other classes. One D is not going to pee on my GPA. Me too. Yeah. yeah. Wait, you guys are all getting A's and B's? Even you, Jocelyn? I mean, you too, Jocelyn? Yeah, I'm brainy. Uh, Tammy's taking a long time, so I'm going to take a sip of her slushy. Don't tell. What is Tammy? She said she was going to go to the dark room for some reason, and she said something about a negative, and I was like, just be positive, girl. Quick question. What's going on? What's... What... What's... Damn it, Jocelyn! What? I'm trying to make it fizzy. It's doing my job. Can I help you? I need to see Jimmy Jr. He's, like, super busy in a meeting or something. Why don't you tell me what it is, and I will tell him. Fine. We need dust masks and band-aids and gloves and a timetable on when we'll be switching jobs. So, you're crabby. Did I get it all? Uh, uh yes. yes. Go ahead. Why do you go to space? Everything's here. This question again. Okay. Where are you guys going? Is it anywhere but here? Yeah, we can't take it in there anymore. I can't stand any more songs that start at different times. Rounds. They're called rounds. What's rounds? Ugh. Can we talk about this later? We gotta find a way down. I don't think we can go down. I think the only way out is up. <laughs> I will kill you if I die out here, Fluffy Butt. Me too. I don't want to die in this jacket. Really? I think that jacket's cute. You do? I totally die in that jacket. No, I want to die in it. Sorry I was all up in your grill about cooking yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> Don't try to be our friend. Um, all right, well, let's fire up Chester the Home Exter meets Dustin the Dustin Cowboy. Those two are always getting into it. Oh, anybody wants some microwave popcorn to go with the movie? Whoops, I ripped the bag. Oh, now we can't have popcorn, idiot. Hey, everybody, maybe there's another way to make popcorn. He's trying to microwave without a microwave. Mr. B's lost it. God, he's lost it. Let's see where he goes with this. Oh, my God, what's happening? We're cooking, Jocelyn. That's what's happening. What's cooking? Hello, songwriters. I'm going to be going around the room, checking on your progress. So bring it on. Or should I say, sing it on. No. My song is just the word whoa over and over, because I like when songs do that. Whoa. I hate it. Whoa. The little Jopolis, the Gomez twins, Juan and Gus. Uh, hey, Tammy. I noticed that your song with the names of all the kids at school doesn't have my name. It's hard to fit them all in, Jocelyn. Get an easier name. I tried. It takes 30 days. Okay. Wearing my mentor hat here. Your songs are crap. <gasps> I'm realizing that children aren't good songwriters, and oh my god, one of these is gonna win. Ours. I can't have another incident with one of my proposals. Bring a stranger to school day was a disaster. <gasps> I'm gonna get so fired. I miss my stranger. She had chicken in her pocket. Ricky Brown, Toby Nero, Caroline Shapiro. These are the names of all the kids at Wagstaff. <sighs> Push Jocelyn. That's me. So where's everybody going for spring break? We're going to a place where you can stand in four states at once. I'm going to stand in California, Hawaii, Canada, and Chicago. Gum chewing is now a class. Oh my god, I might graduate. I heard skeletons are inside all our bodies every day. Hi, it's Jocelyn, live from the nurse's office. I'm filling in for Tammy, because guys, Tammy's got super lice. <laughs> Hi, Tammy, I see you. Hurry up and get better. No, take your time. <laughs> I'm here with Nurse Liz. So what are super lice? Uh, well, Jocelyn, they're parasites. Ew. They live on your hair and chew your head ew. and then drink the blood out of your scalp by Shut sucking up. it out using their little louse bodies as straws. Oh my god, stop talking. And then uh, they poop on you, Jocelyn, and uh, lay millions of lice eggs. I gotta throw up. Uh, Kids with lice are bad, right? <laughs> no. 
<laughs> they aren't bad, but they are disgusting, and we want to protect their identity. Unrelated, will the following 16 children report to the nurse's office for a, uh, neck exam? Jimmy Pesto Jr. Lice. Lenny DiStefano. Lice. Michael Carlish. Lysey. Tracy Schwartz. Super Lysey. Guys, we're in the nurse's office where Nurse Liz is gonna shave kids' heads while we watch. This microphone's heavy, I'm gonna put it down. No, don't do that, okay. So, Tammy, what's next for you? I do the interviews, Jocelyn. What's next for you? No, I have the microphone to like, what's next for you? No, what's next for you, Jocelyn, in your journey to give me the microphone? Oh, I think it's my no, microphone. Jocelyn, I'm, I'm not right now. Give it back. Just get give off it, it right give now. It. Get give off it. it. Give it. Ow. Give it to me. So gross. You're gross. You're my best friend. You're my best friend. I love you. Oh my God! Tina's wearing the same bracelet as you, Tammy. Take it off. I would rather die. Then you will die! Ah! Ah! You're my sister! I don't know what to do! The fire department will fix this! Mom, I can't believe I got detention. Don't even worry about it. You're like really pretty. That is why I have decided to team you up and pitch you against each other in a fashion contest. So far, this all makes sense? Uh, no thanks. If you need me, I'll be zoning out pretty hard over here. And I'm gonna sleep with my eyes open, like this. You heard the man. Let's get started, designers. Good luck, designer whiners. We have immunity. That means we don't have to design an outfit this round, and we can never die. Just the first thing. The second thing is incorrect. How are those harmonies coming, ladies? Try this on for size. Uh, no, no. What? No. Jocelyn, that's not what? a harmony. It's not? No. Do you even know what a harmony is? A harmony is when I sing louder than you. No. Oh. I'm dizzy. She's so quirky. I'm quirky too, right? You wish. What? Hearts are farts, people, and Cupid is stupid. Cupid's just a baby who likes to watch people kiss. And I'm not saying any of this because I don't have a boyfriend. You so don't have a boyfriend, Tammy. Shut it. Okay, Jocelyn, and make a face like, oh my god, I'm doing a good thing and I don't even care who sees. Got it. Great. Um, you kind of just dropped that trash back on the beach after you took your picture. Maybe you want to just pop that in your bag? Don't be a bag nag, Tina. Yeah, my bag's clean. I don't want to get trash on it. Hey, kid. Yeah, kid, you, yeah, hey, come on, vote for me. Come on, help a candidate out. Oh, gross, she's still running. Don't make eye contact, just keep walking. I saw you, Jocelyn. Keep walking. If Tina's report made you tired, get ready to be inspired. New York, baby. Stand behind me, please, Jocelyn. Here? No, behind me. Stop trying to hog attention. You are. I am not, because this is my presentation. I'm sharing my New York story and my truth. You didn't even see New York. <laughs> You told me you stayed in a hotel room because New York smelled like pee and hot dogs. And Shut up, Jocelyn! I told you that in secret! Tammy, Tammy, Tammy. Oh my god, everyone's looking at us. Hey, Tina. Hey, Jimmy Jr. I guess you heard the news about the Eighty Bitty Diddy Committee. Huh? I was gonna tell you that you're standing in front of my locker. Oh, sorry. What's the Eighty Bitty Diddy Committee? Is that one of those improv groups? My cousin was kidnapped by one of them. <sighs> Your hand is sweaty like a forehead. I know. It's an issue. Oh my god, are you two a couple now? You do the math. No. Hey, who's having a great Valentine's Day? Yeah! Well, I'm having a greater time because I'm here with the number one girlfriend in the world. Tito Belcher! Hi. Aw, uh, I want someone to stretch out my name like that. Jocelyn! It's our only choice. I wish I knew how to tame you, you wild stallion. Have a great life. You too, soulful wonder lady. Hey, Rosa. Sorry you had to see that. Man, that was rough. Are you okay, Daryl? I'll be all right. Thanks for asking. You're welcome. That was so intense. I thought they were going to last forever and ever. But instead, they just imploded right before our eyes. So Tina's single again? Why do you want to know? I, I, I don't care. Jimmy Jr. likes Tina. So is, um... Rosa, I'm sorry. I should have just told you I liked you. Yes, you should have. So will you guys press two player already? Are you crazy? She's on the black, castle, on the black level. castle level. Oh, we said the same thing at the same time. You know there's a hidden power up on that level. No, uh really? Want me to show you? Yes. Aww. Oh, they're like Mario and Luigi. They're so in love. 
overhearing teenagers at the pier might not be the best way to get information. Mm, I would agree to disagree because that's actually how I learned that green scrunchies are out. What? Oh my god, you're being paranoid. I told you that I liked it. I know. Wait, 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 wait. Are you jealous of Gina? What? what? Why would I be jealous if Mr. Perfect hears about every two-butter goat in the world? Oh my god, you're so Jean Jelly. You're a Jean Jelly donut. No, I'm not. Fine, I am. I'm gonna pass the zap. Who wants some? I I'll take a zap, Zeke. Ah! Ah, yeah, yeah. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotcha! It tickles and it hurts and I pooped a little, but it went back up. That's what I'm talking about. He gets it. Oh, man. Electricity was literally running between them. No, that was beautiful. I'm so Shut glad you're here. Up. So, Mr. Front. You're the executive producer of the Thanksgiving play, which premieres tomorrow. Which I'm in, as an actor. And I am too, also. Yes, I am the executive producer. This was a real passion project for Have you ever met the people from Bones? Um, no. Do you have a limousine? No, I drive a hatchback. Gross. Do, do you guys want to talk about the play? What play? Did you have plastic surgery? Be real. No. Do you want plastic surgery? No. What? what? If I were you, here's where I'd start. Face. Back. What? Front. Front. Ah! I might just be a local cop. Will you guys back off me? Things are getting pretty tense. Does anybody want coffee? And I just liked him because everyone else liked him. I need to start thinking for myself. Unless you guys don't think that's cool, then I won't. But how about... The chestnut, mm. bony part of the inner side of the leg. The gaskin, muscular part of the hind leg. Willa, why don't we let one of the other girls try to answer? You, what's this? Um, horse. So sad about cows, right? I love ice cream. Me too. And burgers. Wait, burgers or cows? I gotta go do lab stuff. Bye. Oh my god, let's yell at those people in that car. No, please don't. Your car is blue! Drive, 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 drive! How do I get you alone? How do I get you alone?